There are two markers up ahead. Interesting. Okay, the big yellow one is of course the most important one. But I'm gonna do the other one first. Whatever the trouble is over there, it's gonna have to wait. There's somebody here that needs our help as well. Hello, can I help you? Oh, thank goodness. Yes, my name is Grace Pinch Smedley. Of the Bath Pinch Smedleys? I was hoping someone would come along soon. I was about to defy my father's wishes and would never have forgiven myself. You see, I need to retrieve something from the bottom of the lake. Might you be the one to help me? Diving into the lake sounds like an adventure. Tell me more. Splendid. Precisely the response I'd hoped for. What do you need help retrieving? Years ago, my grandfather, who fancied himself quite the astronomer, set sail from Hogsmeade Station for what was meant to be a quick stargazing cruise with my grandmother. They never returned. I'm so sorry. What happened to them? We can't be sure. We only know that neither they nor their boat made it back to shore. They were presumed drowned. Father was so distraught that he forbade our family from setting foot on or in the Black Lake ever again. A treasured family astrolabe vanished with them that night. If you could dive down and retrieve it, I may be able to bring my father some peace. Bringing peace is what I'm all about. You seem to think I might have heard of the Bath Pinch Smedleys. Why would I know your family? That's like asking why the sky is blue or grass is green. The Pinch Smedley name is synonymous with intellectual curiosity. We are known for our contributions to science and art. I'm surprised you haven't heard of us, frankly. But with all I plan to discover about the world around us, those that don't yet know the name certainly one day will. What exactly is an astrolabe? It's an astonishing ancient navigational tool. Essentially, a handheld model of the universe. It's mainly used for studying the stars, astronomical pursuits, but it has nearly a thousand uses. Fascinating device. Sadly, I'd imagine it's rusted beyond repair now. Still, we'd love to have it returned to us. It would be like getting a bit of my grandparents back. Hmm. It sounds dangerous, especially for something of mere sentimental value. I understand. But I'd be forever grateful. Of course, you may discover much more than the astrolabe. Anything else you found would be all yours. I've cross-referenced the vessel's last alleged location against the lake's topography, depth charts, and tide schedule. My best guess is that it's just over there, about a furlong from the dock. It would be wonderful to have my grandfather's astrolabe back. Yeah, we'll take the plunge. I do hope you find the astrolabe. Leap of faith. We'll it would mean it. so much to our family. It sounds as if her astrolabe is just northeast of the dock. I should dive down and see. Do we get a marker? Ah, oh, yes. Thank goodness. This is a huge lake. So that does help. A little bit of swimming in my life. Whoa. Certain areas are not that deep. <laughs> Alright. There's the area. Let's do a little dive. Let's get down tonight. Let's get down tonight. How does this work? Do we actually. This must be where the Pink oh. Smedley family astrolabe is. Well, there's the answer. We don't actually have to dive ourselves and swim on the water. Which I guess is good. This is less work. Do I ever have to find the right little marker? There's another one. Ah, oh, damn it. Gears, let's have fill. Alright, he'll trash some stuff. Which is a shame, you know, selling it is better, but... I don't want to have to go to the shop and then swim all the way back here again, so... Uh. Uh. Hmm. 
yeah, we're not gonna wear this. But I can make it go invisible. They don't have to see it. It's not my look. It's such a big head. All right. Now we can dispose of this one. Oh, there you go, 30 bucks down the drain. Hmm. I think we have a lot of robes. 26. Feeling stronger already. Okay. Let's make it look like our normal outfit. No, wait. Uh, that one. Hmm. Plus nine, plus two, plus thirty. Don't really like it, but does help us. Let's make it look a little different. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. I really don't like these pants. I mean, they're classic, traditional and all, but... Long pants. Better. Ooh, classic. This'll do. This'll do, wizard. This'll do. Still need to trash some stuff. Uh, doo -doo -doo. And this one as well. Alright, with three slots available. You can do a little dive. What do we get? A hat. Yippee. Okay. Uh, another marker? Over here. No. Still not it. How about this? Got it. Excellent. I should let Grace know that I found her family astrolabe. Come on, lady. Wait for me. Oh, we can swim pretty fast. That's nice. Doesn't slow us down at all. But if this thing is all rusted and stuff like that, can she just use, like, Reparo? The same. There's probably some sort of magic spell which you can use. Uh, maybe I'm overthinking it. I didn't find the dive too terribly difficult. The water's cold. Be, 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 be. Okay, lady, got your loot. Hello, Grace. I followed your bearings on a dive in the Black Lake. Oh, how incredible! Did you find the astrolabe? Ah, oh, there's also mean answers. I did. I hope it makes your father happy. It will. I can't wait to see his face. Thank you so much for doing this for me. And for my family. You do well to keep an eye out for more spots to dive. A diver of your caliber is certain to find all sorts of things down there. Thank you again. And I do hope you keep diving. You certainly have a knack for finding treasure. Well, you told us where to look, but still, thank you very much. You got a creepy mask out of it. Always good, always nice.